Megan here, and welcome back to MNG Productions. Today I'm going to do a back to school supplies haul. So let's get started. So for my school, we have two different days. So on the first day, we'll have four class. We'll have three classes and then homeroom, and then the second day we'll have our other three classes and homeroom. So since I have two days of classes, I have two different backpacks. So we're going to start with my A-Day backpack. So this is my A-Day backpack. I'm using the same ones as last year just because I didn't feel like getting new ones. I don't know why. And I've used this backpack for a while now and it's still in pretty good shape. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be using this year. So let's start with my pencil case. So this pencil case I used last year but it's still like again in pretty good shape so I'll be using this pencil case and it's just blue chevron and inside I have the first pocket I have some crazy art markers I have more but I just didn't feel like pulling them out all out so I have those for my language arts class and any other classes that I want to use them in and then I have colored pencils. I also have more in my pencil case, but I'm going to be, I'm not going to show you all my colored pencils. And those I'm going to use for multiple classes as well. Then I have a flash drive for my course class. And so in the big pouch, I have a dry erase marker, some blue pens and some black pens, some scissors, a pencil sharpener, glue sticks, mechanical pencils, regular pencils, Then I have some highlighters. I have a pink, yellow, and green. So that's it for my pencil case. The next thing I have in my backpack is a ruler for some class, who knows. But I have this. So yeah. And then I have this planner, which you might recognize from Grace's video, because we have the same one. So at our sleepover that we had, not the last one we had, but the one before we had our YouTube channel, we she got us planners to do. So we made them, and it's super good to have. I really like it. It's very decorative, and it's just, you know, it's, I like my planner. So in... So, next I have my binder that I'm going to use for science. It currently has nothing in it because I'm going to be leaving it in the classroom. So, I'm not going to be using it. It's not going to be staying in my backpack. So, I don't have anything in it. Then, I have my language arts binder. And in my language arts binder, I just have some loose leaf paper. And I really like these too. I like these blue colors. They're very wonderful. This one kind of matches the color of my wall. That's weird. Okay. And then next I have another binder for my choir class. And it's just a plain black binder because we're only allowed to have black binders. So in my chorus binder, I have a pencil, a highlighter. Next, I have a five subject notebook for my civics class. It's a five star notebook and it's really like good. These are really good, and it has little folders where I can put work and stuff. Next, I have a black folder, and this is my science folder, and inside I just have some loose leaf paper, and it's just plain black, and it's also a five-star folder. Next, I have this purple folder, which is, I think it's my language arts folder. Um, uh, yeah. Inside, I just have 
my summer reading assignments, and then I have some loose leaf paper. So that's everything in the large pocket of my first backpack. So, Then in the small front pocket, I just have a pair of headphones for some of my classes because we have computers in our classrooms and so I need headphones for those. I have a pack of tissues that just say they're Kleenex and they see, say seize the moment, seize this moment. And then I have a box of crayons and some post-it notes and some index cards. So that's it for my first backpack. In my second backpack, sorry the camera moved. In my second backpack, I have, this one is from Pottery Barn Teen, and the blue one is from L.L. Bean, and they're both really good. I really like their backpacks. So, in this first top po pocket right here, which you can't really see, but there is a pocket up there. There we go. That little pocket. We have another pack of tissues that just say seize this moment on it. And I have a pair of earbuds for my computer class and any other classes I'm going to take that we're going to use computers. So then in the big pocket, we have my pencil case. Inside my pencil case, I just have these flare pen markers I got last year for my language art class. But I decided to use, put them in here just in case and for my language arts class this year. Next, I have some more colored pencils, and I have my computer's USB drive. In the big pocket, I have a dry erase eraser, blue and black pens, a dry erase marker, scissors, two glue sticks, some pencils, some mechanical pencils, and then I have three highlighters. So I have yellow, purple, and orange. So basically the same thing as my other pencil case, but kind of different, but not majorly different. So they're just kind of the same. And any other classes I'm going to take that we're going to use computers. So then in the big pocket, we have my pencil case. Inside my pencil case, I just have these flare pen markers I got last year for my language art class, but I decided to use, put them in here just in case and for my language arts class this year. Next, I have some more colored pencils and I have my computer's USB drive. In the big pocket, I have a dry erase eraser, blue and black pens, a dry erase marker, scissors, two glue sticks, some pencils, some mechanical pencils, and then I have three highlighters, so I have yellow, purple, and orange. So basically the same thing as my other pencil case, but kind of different, but not majorly different. So they're just kind of the same. So, in this pocket I have my 
my cross is this far? <laughs> I can't remember. But this purple binder for oh my Spanish class. So I have this, and inside I have four different dividers. So I have like a yellow one, a green one, a blue one, and a purple one. And then I have loose leaf paper. And then I have this notebook for my math class. And it's really cute. My mom had one last year for her job that looked kind of like this. So I decided to get this one. And I really like it. So yeah. This is my notebook. It's really cute. I like it a lot. Okay, next thing. So again, I have another roller, just in case. I had one from last year, so I just decided to put it in there. Because you know, you don't know, you never know when you're going to your roller. So then this is my math folder. And inside I have loose leaf paper, and then the very back I have graph paper, and it's this really pretty blue color. So I really like that. And then I have stuff in this smaller pocket. So in this pocket, I have my calculator from last year. I am getting a new one, but I thought it would just be handy to have another one just in case. I have some index cards. And some post-it notes. And I also have a spare flash drive just in case I need another one for some class. So yeah, that's everything that I got for my for back to school. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and Make sure to watch out for some more videos coming up, like a get ready with me for the first day of school, which Grace and I will both be filming. And those will be coming out tomorrow. And then I will be filming a story time at some point. And I think Grace is uploading a truth or dare video. So yeah, watch out for those. And you've got to like, you've got to subscribe and you've got to comment down below what you want in our next video so i'll see you guys next time and it's megan out bye guys